Hi everyone, Infinity here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you're here and I hope that you're doing well. Today's video, I want to share with you some tips from the DLC that will make your DLC life a little bit better and a little bit easier. So let's head out to the coasts of Krokia. Let's go talk to that big frog and let's get swallowed up by him and enter the DLC. So the first thing you're going to want to do is visit Lem and upgrade your conch as soon as possible. And the reason for this is because every conch upgrade allows you to talk to more and more critters. So initially it's going to say you don't know how this critter's language yet because we are just given the amateur conch in the beginning. Once you update it, you'll be able to talk to more and more critters. The next tip that I want to share with you guys is Go into these little puddles on these leaves because each one of these puddles has a little treat for us. So the next thing I want to show you guys is befriending the critters. If you end up with multiple species, you can actually only be buddies with one of each critter type. So it's actually going to make you choose who to keep, and who to let go. These big leaves with the shiny stuff in the middle, they are springs, so definitely use those and you can access some of the higher parts and the higher levels of this realm. So once you enter the DLC realm, you're going to be given this buddy binder. This is where you're going to keep track of all of the critters that you have befriended. But if you actually go in to one of the critters, it gives you some options. You you can tell them to stop following you, you can give them a trinket, and so much more. So definitely take a look at your buddy finder. This next tip isn't a part of the DLC realm, but you will notice all of your pets now, they each are highlighted with a ring underneath. So you know which pet you're actually petting or brushing and this definitely makes life so much easier because I don't know about you guys and your animals, mine bunch together and mine are sometimes even inside of each other and you just end up petting the same one over and over and over again. So this definitely does help identify which pet you've already taken care of. The next thing I want to talk about are these trinkets and all of the items that you need in order to purchase them. So definitely stock up, but what this means is you do have to go back into the mines, all three of them, and start gathering up all of the gems and all of the other items that are in there if you haven't already stocked up, because you're going to need a lot of them. I'm sure there are going to be a lot more tips and tricks to make your DLC life easier but these are what I found so far in the few hours that I played. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, I would love it if you'd leave a comment and a like. 
because it does help me out a lot. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!